Independence presidential aspirant Marek Kofi Gan is questioning the independence of the Electoral Commission. Mr. Gan says the appointment of Jean Menta by the current administration clearly raises issues on influence that they can have on her. The Electoral Commission has been criticized by the opposition in D.C. for compiling the new voters register, a decision which falls in line with the wishes of the NPP when it was in opposition. Speaking on Prime Morning on Joy Prime TV, the candidate said the real question is on how much the commission can be independent. If you appoint somebody in a position, that, that appointment itself is, is influenced because you, you've just given that person a job. But an Article 72 <laughs> holders, mm. uh, office holders um, tenure is secured. Mm. And so it that's is, supposed it's not to about the security the of the uh, tenure, it's about who puts you there. And if the person who puts you there is also somebody you need to uh, work towards, or in some cases say no to, influence is always going to play a part in that. I mean, it's, it's, it's one of the things in our constitution that we feel needs to get changed, for example, because if, if, if I appoint you as a, unless you're one of the tough cookies, which is what we need. I mean, Obama came here and said we don't need tough men or uh, we don't need strong men, or we need strong institution. The truth is that we actually need some strong men with some really independent minds of thinking and, and we can have them say, you know what, well, I know you appointed me, but this is a no and this is a yes. You know, but in the current circumstances, that, that, that does not exist. Uh, so. I can't tell you whether Jin Mensa is being influenced by the government or not, but uh, there exists influence. Whether he uses her? it or not, do I trust her? Well, we must in the circumstances. But ex influence exists, as you say. Influence is always going to exist. It's one thing for influence to exist, it's another thing whether it's being leveraged. Reacting to Vice President Dr. Mahmoud Baumia's announcement of a $200 million facility from the World Bank for job creation, Mr. Gan said the monies will be misapplied. The money is a good idea. What they are going to use it for is another thing altogether. I haven't seen what... We've had this kind of money being given to us almost every other three years, in my estimating, in the last couple of years. Um, so... You know, we haven't seen anything tangible that has been done with this money. So, yes, the money is always good, but what it's put to is, is always going to be the question. So you're not confident that it would actually be used to do what it's meant to do? I have never been confident.